Hello everyone, I hope you have watched the previous video in which I have discussed about how does photosynthesis occur in plants. Now I have repeatedly told you all whenever we did photosynthesis that carbon dioxide, water, sunlight and chlorophyll are necessary for photosynthesis. Okay, so today we will be uh, discussing about how can we prove that sunlight is necessary for photosynthesis. Okay, so we take a plant, we take a potted plant, okay, we take a potted plant. And then we keep it in a dark room for about 48 hours. Now why are we keeping it in a dark room for 48 hours is to destructure it. That means, I have already told you, excess glucose, excess glucose is stored in plants in the form of starch. And whenever glucose is required, the starch is reutilized is converted to glucose and is utilized by the plant. Now when I keep it in a dark room, that means no light is there, plants cannot perform photosynthesis and then so the starch, the stored starch has to be utilized by the plant. So whenever we perform any experiment for photosynthesis, it is necessary to de-starch the plant. Okay, so we, how do we de-starch a plant? We keep it in a dark room for about 48 hours. Okay, now after 48 hours, I take out this plant and then without plucking the leaf, I'm just drawing it here so that it becomes clear. Without plucking the leaf, I cover it with black paper. I cover it with black paper. Okay, so that no light falls on it. So, what did I do? I discharged the plant and then after 48 hours, on one of the leaves, I covered half the portion of the leaf with black paper. I leave it in sunlight for a few hours. Okay, after a few hours, now I pluck the leaf. Okay, and I remove the black paper. Now I test it for starch. Now, we have already destarched the plant, remember? So now, starch will be formed only if photosynthesis has occurred. Okay? Now, how do we test a plant for starch? We take a solution of iodine. Again, we take iodine solution. And iodine solution turns blue-black. If starch is present and it turns brown, if starch is absent. Okay, so I pluck the leaf and I test it with iodine solution. I find that the portion which was not covered turns blue black. So the portion which was not covered with black paper turns blue black showing that starch is present and this portion turns brown showing that excuse me starch is absent so what happened is when this plant was kept in the sunlight the portion which was not covered that means they, they got sunlight so chlorophyll could absorb the sunlight and photosynthesis occurred and its glucose was formed and excess glucose was converted into starch. But this portion was covered with black paper. That means sunlight could not fall in it. The chlorophyll could not absorb sunlight. Hence glucose could not be produced. So this experiment proves that sunlight is very important for photosynthesis. I hope you have understood this experiment very easy. You can try it at home. Of course, getting iodine solution is quite difficult. But if you try, you may get it in a medical shop. 
So please keep watching my videos for more experiments on photosynthesis. Thank you. Bye-bye.